كده بيسولوا Uh, in the next five minutes, we're going to speak to Mr. Ahmed Shawish. Mr. Ahmed Shawish, um, I want you to introduce yourself to my viewers. Okay, my name is uh, Ahmed uh, Shawish King. I was born in South Sudan, and uh, I have uh, first, uh, first I have a dedica my education was in uh, Bahrain country, the, one of the Gulf region. Uh, old, and then I came here to Egypt and then I traveled to USA uh, studied there and worked there uh, for a while and also uh, I learned a lot yeah I want you to speak to me about your experience learning English in particular okay so when uh, when I went over there to US first I rely on listening I used to listen to radio a lot, like uh, talk shows, conversations, radio, like news, news, and uh, I didn't watch TV a lot, but I used to rely on listening. And then when I went to school, I, uh, I, I improved my uh, braille in English. Also, that's improved my spelling. So your braille that helps you to read and write. Read correct? and write in English. Yes, correct. Yeah, and also helped me after. And then after when I got, when we got to the computer age, in 2001, 2002, um, uh, because I or, or, or because already I know braille in English. So when I learn writing and typing in keyboard computer, um, uh, I learn it faster. Okay, so the basic Braille courses that you had when you were in Sudan okay. helped you to learn faster when you went to the States, correct? Yes. Okay, is there or were there any challenges? Uh, there, there, were some, uh, there were some challenges, but alhamdulillah, I, I overcome them. Okay, can you talk about one of them? Oh, like... Uh, uh, when when I first uh, I, when I uh, first I tried to take my GED classes, uh, there 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 is there was class in English, and that means to study English in in depth. Okay. English in depth. So it was there were some word, some words were new to me, to me. So, so like their new vocabulary. Like new vocabularies. Yes. Okay. So I have to learn them. And also, when you uh, com in composition, also uh, their meaning not yeah not meaning literally, but different. It means something like what we have in Arabic istihara. That yeah. one I didn't know in English. Also, the idioms, and right? Idioms like so. so talks about that gave me some challenges. As, yeah, as well. Yes, we talked about it early when. You say, for example, if it's raining, then you could say it rains do cats and dogs, right? Cats and dogs, yes. Yeah. Like so, raining, uh, raining like a hell, like they, they, what they say. Yeah, they, because cats and dogs, they run after each other fast. So yes, like so that, it yes. rains a lot. Mm. Yeah, it's, it's called heavy rain. Right. Yeah. Now, um, so you have an experience learning English even though you can't see, right? Mm -hmm. So what's your advice to those who can uh, read and write and they can see? Well, everything depends on the, uh, the person's will. If, um, you have, if you have the will, yes, you will learn, inshallah. Regardless. If, regardless of you, you have sight, you have no sight, you can, you can learn. Whenever, by sight, but, he but, means like the ability to see. To see. That's what right. he means, right? Right. Yeah. That's called eyesight. Yes. If you can see or you don't see, if you have the willing to learn, you can learn. Like you what we learn. call in Arabic, in irada. Yes. If you have the irada, you can learn. Yes. If you have the irada, you can learn. Because you don't want to learn. So if you have the will, then you can learn. Yes. Yeah. Nothing is going to stop you from right. learning. If you don't have will, then you will not learn because you don't have a will to learn. Yeah. Uh, if, the reason I'm talking if the child, to... If the child don't want to walk and you keep telling him, oh, go walk, and he doesn't want to walk, 
Then he, he will never, never walk. walk. Right. Yeah. He will never walk. Uh, the reason I'm talking about this because to tell you that even though Brother Ahmed is deprived yeah. from the sight, he can't see, but he is able to dedicate himself. That, that's the point. And I still, I still try learning. Uh, I try to learn a lot about what's going on in my life and in other people's life and the ch challenges we face day by day. And you use your, your, your smartphone actively, correct? Correct, yes. Yeah. And you, you said, you told me that you attended oh. some um, uh, conferences right. over the Zoom exactly, application, yes. right? Yes, application, yes. yeah. We use Zoom, we use Clubhouse, we use Facebook, we use Twitter, Twitter we use WhatsApp, all the media. Uh, the social, social media, media. All yeah. the social media helps yes, yes, uh, yes. you to improve yeah. and to you move on with your right. uh, learning. Right. Yeah. So, and also I, listening to, I listen to book and also in English a lot also. And I read, I have some books in my iPhone so I can read them, the, the device, the the voice over my uh, screen uh, reader I use it read to me some books and uh, so let me see try to uh, do something so we can okay read. show us example yeah. right exactly. yeah all right so you turn on your phone now right right yes okay my phone is on now I try to open uh, one of the books. The I'm applications reading. is a book, right? Yeah. yeah Turn is. it on. No, I made the screen dark because nobody would know what I'm doing with my phone. Okay. Because there are some people, they have a lot of curiosity. Yeah. So when I switch, I'm using we'll my call phone. Them they're nosy. Nosy, exactly. <laughs> they say, oh, you don't know what you use? How are you using your phone? <laughs> so they try to teach me. Oh no, let me let me show you. Who do you want to call? <laughs> so I make the screen completely dark. Nobody will see what I'm doing. Yeah. You see? You're gonna show me one, right? Right. Show me that. Play one for me. Right. So. There is a book here I am reading. Okay, now you can see the screen. Yeah, I can see the screen. Now this is a book I am reading. Yeah, that's the book here I'm reading. Yeah. And you understand it all, right? Right. Well, that's great. Thank you very yeah, much. No problem. So, see the t determination. Right. If you have it there, you can educate yourself. Learning English is not a big deal. Especially we have these modern gadgets. We have the devices. We have a smartphone. We have iPads, we have a lot of things that help us to uh, educate our uh, students. Do you want to say anything? No, I appreciate uh, your time and thank you for your visit. And, uh, I couldn't thank you enough for okay. coming over here. Yeah, you're, you're most, most welcome. And this video for my viewers, uh, those who are interested in learning English, I would urge them to make efforts in order to uh, improve their English. It's not a big deal, it's not that hard, it's not difficult. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.